Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have a collective clothing haul from ASOS, PLT and Primark, I'm pretty sure. So if this seems interesting to you, then please keep on watching. Okay, so I ventured into Primark um, the other day. I think that video's gone up already. Um, like I come to Primark with me. So if you've not seen that, please do. Um, I don't know if <laughs> it's your type of thing um, but firstly I got some tights which is pretty boring but I feel like you just need them I like the 40 like thickness <laughs> is it den denier um three pound I feel like you can't go wrong and it's cold like winter is cold <laughs> but yeah don't forget to pick up tights um i don't like thicker ones than these though I, I don't know why even though it's cold i just like a thin a thin layer of tight if that makes sense and this isn't clothing related and it's really random but primark do bath bombs they're only a pound i mean perfect stocking filler but it's a little spaceship that is so cool. I am very happy that I got that. I don't know why. Um, I just can't wait to have a bath though. With that bath bomb. Like, it's not quite lush, but it's cheap. Um, so, next I have this shirt on. By Collusion. I also have um, a white shirt dress, which I, prob I think was... In my autumn styling video but they've come out with like these bra honestly collusion shirts right you need to size down like two or at least once because they are big this one's still big but i feel like i, I can get away with the li a little bit oversized um and shirt dresses are the best like everyone needs like a black and a white one but like i literally need all the browns like the brown i wish i had brown nails still but the red's still cute um yeah but this is a shirt from collusion just like a cotton shirt um i should probably go to the side so i can do a split screen and make it easier for myself um or i don't know i could do a picture in a picture we we don't know these editing skills are a bit limited let me tell you um but yeah it's so comfy i'm pretty sure they are 20 pound 20 or 18 pound can't go wrong they had a chocolate brown one but they only had like the biggest size which it was like a 26 i want it though but yeah definitely size down they're so cute and it's like a mo i think this shade was called mocha um but i really want the chocolate one as well so i'm definitely going to keep my eye out for when that's back in stock but like shirt dresses with anything anything i will take it now i think they have pink a pink shirt one as well and i remember buying it but i think i bought it like to be oversized but it was massive oh my god you did okay let's move on to some clothing items i got um this like you know like the style of everyone wearing some over a shirt well they've now come out with crop tops that have shoulder pads in um i wish i'd got a small uh, smaller size i think this is a large um because it's quite long and I, I don't want it to be long does that make sense um i don't know i feel like it looks a bit i can't play with some toys but yeah it looks like this the shoulder pads i feel like they're not too much it's so soft though like honestly it's a really good material um it was 10 pounds but you know what i mean i feel like it is it's just like quite boxy then it goes down which i do like so i feel like it can cinch you in but i feel like i'd needed a smaller size does she mind selena she's got mental um but yeah i feel like I don't mind it though, as you can see on like the try and clip, I feel like it does look quite nice but um, sometimes I'm not too sure about the style, like if I do like it or not. I love my like um, dog tooth print but I don't know, I feel like even with this shirt, like the, the black and the browns, 
I feel like they just go. But yeah, um, I didn't see any other colours in Primark of these though, which is quite annoying. Um, but you just never know. Oh yeah, I got some leggings. You can't go wrong. Five pound regular leggings. Um, my cat is going to ruin this video. But yeah. I gotta go sort of. So yeah, I'm not gonna do a try on clip because it's literally just basic leggings, but you have, do you not just have to pick up leggings? I feel like you do. They have some for three pound as well, but I thought I'd just get the ones that are a little bit thicker because they are quite see-through. Sometimes, you can't, you can't say it's not. Ooh, what's next? Um, I might show a coat okay so this i literally went into primark and i was like i want a black trench coat i want something like a long line black trench i want to like wear a black hoodie under it i want black boots i want like black sunglasses i want that kind of vibe with this so they had this one and it was only 23 pounds i'm pretty sure 23 pound i got it um a couple sizes bigger um, and it comes up quite small, so I'm glad I did that. But I didn't want it to be—I wanted it to be a bit bigger, but like it's still wearable. It's just a bit tight on the arms when you got a hoodie on. But yeah, here it is. It'll be easy to see on the try-on clip, but it's literally just like a light trench coat, um, which are my new favourite things at the minute. Um, yeah, it, it like cinches you in, as you can see at the back. Um, that's what I like as well. You can proper tie your waist in or you can just leave it open. I prefer to leave like trench coats open. I feel like they look quite cool. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely here for the trench coat vibe. I never used to get them because I always used to think I was like too small because I'm 5'3", five, 5'2". Five, um, but yeah, long sleeved. Um, I didn't see any other colours, but they definitely did have a beige one um, in a different part of the Primark. <laughs> As they do, they don't put them together. Um, but yeah, I'd highly recommend this. It's so comfy and I've never been into trench coats until now and now I want every single colour. I've got three coats in this haul, by the way. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I filmed the try on clips before this, so everything is inside out okay so i think this is the last thing i got from primark i didn't get too much it was a it was quite a disappointing trip and that makes me upset and that i think that we should go to another primark and film another come to primark with me what do you think i don't have a haul um so i got these men's joggers you can't go wrong can you I have navy black and grey of these so I thought I'd get like a lighter colour um it's like a speckled I don't know I feel like they're like off white speckled that's probably the best way to put it um so soft comes with pockets back pockets and do you not think everyone just needs a pair of these they're about five pounds and they had matching sweat um sweatshirts um which i was gonna get but like i just wouldn't have worn it like i just wouldn't like these are just for like laying in the house for me next we can talk about asos oh my god i ordered two pairs of boots and i was like i'm gonna style them in this hole they're gonna be amazing they both looked awful and just didn't fit it was so annoying like i got some knee-high boots which they just weren't a good length like they're just there's something about them and then i got um this other pair which looked amazing and i put them on and they just didn't look right on me like i have like stubby short legs like if i had long legs that were like slim i think they would have looked better so just pretend that they were really nice boots in this cup chloe hall sorry my cat's at it again playing with paper um so yeah first i can't believe that i do not own a plain black hoodie but i got this one what are all these noises for on my streets right now so yeah i got this plain black hoodie 
I think I'm gonna wear it with tights, cycling shorts, leggings with like the trench coat on top. Um, it was £14 in the sale on ASOS and it's literally like I got it in a bigger size so it would be baggy, it's got pockets at the front. Oh, I've literally worn this like all week, it's literally my favourite thing ever. I think I'm gonna buy, um, I think I'm gonna buy a grey one as well that are like plain. I have a black um, Adidas one but I feel like you just need sometimes a plain black hoodie. So I styled it with... Um, a black blazer which is also from Primark um I don't know if they still have that one in stock but it's like a long line one it's always in like the work style part <laughs> you know it's like shirts and blazers and stuff like that of your Primark um but I styled it with that blazer because that's like the kind of vibe I want like boots a blazer and um, probably some cycling shorts because the hoodie isn't big enough um to be a dress and then like go out of the house looking like all grow up. I don't know, I feel like the vibe, even with sunglasses, like winter sun, you know? But yeah, I'd highly recommend that. Um, and it looks really good with the trench coat from the other try on clip. Does no one else agree? I think they were soulmates and they were made for each other basically. But yeah. As I'm filming this, by the way, I'm expecting one more um, thing to come. So, he said it was going to come between four and six. Let's ignore that. He said it was going to come between four and six and it's like around five now. So I'm hoping it's going to come and fit um, because it looks so cute. So I might add that on somewhere here because it's also from ASOS. But if that, the lighting changes, something like that. I'm sorry. Um... But yeah, next, oh, this coat. So this coat and another coat I'm gonna show you, um, my boyfriend got me for my birthday, which is in a month. But he said I could have them both early because I really wanted, I just really wanted a coat for winter. And I, I was gonna get one, but he was like, I'll get it as an early birthday present. So it's massive. And it was quite expensive, but look at this. <laughs> it's a faux leather. Um, woolly coat like I mean does is this not winter in a coat like it, I mean the try on clip will do it more just if you're me like rolling around with this coat <laughs> um but yeah it's got pockets faux leather um I just love these details as well but it's like got the um I don't know like woolly just like the woolly bits hanging out as well as inside like the collar This is my favourite coat in the whole world. Like, I just can't wait to wear it. I can't wait for it to get even colder. Like, imagine, like, walking around Edinburgh in this coat. Oh, so you didn't like that. Um, but, yeah, I think I'm going to wear this coat everywhere. And this was quite expensive. I think it was around £70, which is, like, extortionate. Like, I probably would never spend that much on a coat for myself. So it was really nice to have it as a gift. And it's literally my favourite thing ever and I've got to cherish it for years. So, let's have a break from the clothes. I say that like I've got loads. It's literally like the smallest haul you're probably ever going to watch. <laughs> but, let's talk about hats. So, what do we all think about bucket hats? Because I'm not really a big fan of like the normal style where it's just like cotton um, or even like just branded ones I don't really think they're a bit of me but as soon as it gets cold like I have a white one that I always wear um and then now I have this one which is like a black borg one so it's like dead fluffy and dead cute I feel like it looks quite chocolate brown on camera to me I've got a try on clip but do you not think this is like I'm going to the Christmas markets that aren't even on this year, which makes me extremely sad. Um, but what do you all think? I feel like it's a bit of me. Like, this was from PLT, and I think it's around £15. And I don't know. There's just something about, um, like, warm-looking bucket hats. You know when everyone used to wear them things around their head? Like, that, um, when we were... I don't know how old people were... And, like, people used to wear the hair flan, these massive, like, 
fluffy headbands like out i feel like this is like the grown-up version of them um but yeah this is probably one of my favorite things i've ever bought i just love it look at my cat there what are you doing apparently she's going to sit right there for the rest of the video so next is another little gift an early b-day present trench trench coats oh she's not happy in there now is she come on out you get attention seeker there we go so obviously the try and clip will do it justice but because it's like a cream well beige it's a beige trench it goes it goes probably longer than the black one um this is from plt as well if i haven't already said it's got like to a shell buttons going all the way down it came with a belt as well but like, i just took that straight off i want to wear it open um but this is on sale at the minute for 27 pounds um in case anyone is interested well it was last time i checked if it's not anymore i'm sorry but plt have a lot of discounts on um oh god it's like this isn't going to keep you warm but it's a good layer in peace like i want to wear like a white hoodie under this or a white jumper and have this or a white jumper dress even a black jumper dress like with boots or with trainers and like some cool sunglasses or even like my white fluffy hat and then for the black trench the like black fluffy hat honestly i don't know what it is about trench coats but like i'm quite small so i thought they'd drown me but then this one literally doesn't but i tried to get ones on the clip you know, no, the picture, or sometimes they do give you a video clip on PLT and ASOS, which is very kind. Um, if they look like they go right to the floor and models are like, what, 5'11? I'm like, that is not going to fit me. So I have to get a midi one um, for it to be a trench. But this doesn't go all the way to the floor. It's really good. It needs a good iron. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I put this on my Instagram recently. It's my new favourite coat because it is. I'm going to be wearing this all the time. Um, but yeah, I feel like everyone needs a trench coat in their life. I don't really know what else to say. It's just not warm, but I think they're so stylish. Like, and just with boots, I feel like I feel like a spy. That's what I feel like. A cool winter spy. In a weird way. But I love it. I'm here for it. It arrived. Close that. Mess. Stinks of smoke but that's fine live on camera open I'm trying to open this carefully in case I need to take it back how cute it's quite big um but i'm pretty sure i got my size um i can't remember it says season 20 edition and it is a jumper dress so oh my god it's so soft i love anything that has a half zip and then inside it's so soft and woolly. <gasps> what do we all think of like the oatmeal color and then the season 20 in the middle and then like maybe with boots or like the trench coat on top. Oh my God. I'm so excited to style this, but I didn't think it, um, I mean, it just needs a wash. I didn't think, I thought it'd be smaller than this though. Um, but I mean, anything oversized not fitting is so flattering on me what do you all think i will quickly film a little try on clip <laughs> which will be in here it might be different to the others i'm really sorry but it's completely pitch black outside at this point and the other ones um i did want this to come earlier but you know it's okay yay it came i love it It's a bit longer than I would want, but 
I feel like it looks okay though at the same time. Um, oh my god, how awkward would it have been if I didn't like it and there was no try on clip? Um, but yeah, it's like the coziest jumper ever. It's a bit, um, a tiny bit big, but that just makes it look even better. So yeah, yay! Please let me know what other videos you'd like to see. Um, I have so many ideas, and which is quite weird because I upload like literally like nearly every day. Um, but I'm just never running out of ideas at this point. Um, I feel like things just pop up all the time that you want to do. Um, like I'd love to do more shops and clothing hauls and stuff, but then obviously like money is so difficult right now. I don't really want to promote like loads of stuff. So this was just like a small haul, but. Um, at the same time it's like we're allowed to treat ourselves once in a while and it's nice to know um, the odd little thing that's out there but if you'd rather see more videos that are like come to H&M, come to Primark, like just so you can have a look at everything and see what sort of things you like then please let me know. If you want another styling video um, let me know because I, I just love my new coats. Thank you for watching this clothing haul. I hope this inspired anyone. Um, it was quite small, but you know, times are hard for money. But it's nice to treat yourself once in a while. So yeah, I hope somebody enjoyed this video. If you didn't, that's pretty awkward, but it's okay. And yeah, see you for the next one. Bye.